Welcome everyone to this practice. My name is Anna and I will be guiding you through a few yin poses. We're going to start seated down on the mat. So you can either be sitting on your mat or if your knees are up really high when you are in a cross-legged position, which is which what we will take, you can come sit up onto a bolster just so you, they're nice and low below your hips. From here, we're going to start with three deep in-breaths and exhales. So we're going to inhale, our shoulders come up, and we're going to exhale, shoulders come down. We're going to inhale, exhale. And our last song, we're going to take a deep breath in, shoulders come up, exhale, rolling them back. We're going to place our left hand onto the mat and we're going to inhale our right hand up. In our next exhale, we're going to walk our left hand all the way to the side far as possible, we're really going to bring the stretch into the right side of our body. We're looking up towards your elbow. We're going to take three deep breaths here. And the last one. Your next inhale is going to pull you all the way back up again. Exhale, placing your hand down. Inhale, your left arm comes all the way up. Exhale, walking your right arm down, upwards on the mat, coming into that side stretch. And again, we're going to take three deep breaths here. Really feel that you're pushing that left sitting bone down into the mat, bolster. Feeling that stretch, opening up that side body. And on your next inhale, you're going to come all the way back up and exhale, placing your hand down. I'm going to ask you to come off your bolster if you are sitting on one, and just place it next to you. Keep it close by because we will be using it in a little bit. So you can place your feet together in front of you. I want to ask you to make a nice big diamond shape so you're nice and comfortable. You can really sit up nice and tall. Again, if you would like, you can also put some uh, cushions underneath your knees over here, just so you can fully relax into this posture. From here, you're going to take hold of your ankles, if this is accessible for you, and you can pull yourself a little bit more to the front. You can stay here, or you can let your head drop down and really also feel that stretch into your neck and in between your shoulder blades. And we'll be staying here for another five deep breaths. Feel yourself sinking down a little lower. Inhale, you're going to gently roll yourself up, placing your hands behind you, bringing your knees towards each other, and just letting them drop from side to side by doing your fingers. From here, we're going to come into our deer pose. So I'm going to ask you to place your right leg in front of you like this, it's a 90 degree angle and your left leg comes behind you. It might be nice for you to take your bolster and to put it in front of you, if you'd like, so you can really push yourself up nice and tall, opening up that back foot, really stretching into that. And if you would like to go a bit further, you can walk your hands to the front and rest onto your arms or let your head rest all the way onto the bolster, yogi's choice. So also here, we're going to stay for a few breaths. 